Welcome back to another recap. This time we're going to be reviewing Ergo Proxy, one of my favorite anime and the most complex, I would say. This series is set in a dystopian future after an ecological disaster thousands of years prior to the outside world, inhospitable towards life, doomed cities were built as safe heavens for the population. Inside these dooms, humans and android coexist peacefully. A series of murders were committed by outer reviews infected with the Cognito virus begins to threaten the delicate balance of the city's so social order. Behind the scenes, the government has been conducting secret experiments on a mysterious humanoid life form called Proxy. These Proxy's beings are said to hold the very key to the survival of the humanity. Riel is a citizen mayor. The regent's granddaughter is assigned to investigate the murders with her outer weave partner, Iggy. She encounters two unknown and highly powerful humanoids. She later learns that those humanoids are the proxies. The control and the central character, an immigrant named Vincent Law, is revealed to be connected in some ways with this kind of proxies. After being hunted down, Vincent temporarily lives in a commune on the outside of the doom. Vincent has no full memories of his life and in an attempt to recover and find the truth, during a series of events he falls in love with Riel, and together they meet Pino also, a young orphan girl that helps them a lot around. Ergo wants to confront Monad personally, but instead is lured to Riel who is another form of Monad. Vincent transformed into Ergo Proxy who crashes into Riel's bathroom. Riel later rejoins him to try to discover the truth behind the proxies and the dooms. Without knowing yet, he is the half proxy. It is re revealed among other things that the dooms are all created by proxies and cannot function in any way without their presence. Along with many other mosque citizens, Riel also thinks Proxy 1 is Vincent at first, but realizes the truth when Ergo walk walks into the throne room and it is surprised at seeing Dawn of Dead and the proxies fighting over to confront Monad, the White Angel. Riel realizes someone has been manipulating them in their journey in the shadows all along. Ergo has most of his memories back by now. This was all Proxy One's plan. He dies knowing Vincent will confront the creators like he had wanted him to since the beginning. In the meantime, Riel was attempting to escape an explosion. She was rescued by Pino, coming with a wind ship. They go back to Vincent up from the creator's dawn. Vincent stands on top of Ramadil, looking at the spaceships coming from the creators, returning to the city. Vincent has no split personality anymore. This time, he and Ergo have merged together into only one person. Vincent looks at the ships with blue eyes, stating he is Ergo Proxy, the agent of death. And that's how the story ends. Thank you for watching.